Hey, what's up guys? <laughs> hey, quick update. I know we already did one video today. Uh, wasn't going to have another one, but we do. We did one video the other day talking about what Royal Caribbean did. Well, guess what? It is follow the leader. So just announced, let me grab, oh, let me grab it. Let me grab it so you'll know what it says. This is for our upcoming cruise. So you just cruise news. Breaking here today. Press that like, press that subscribe. You're gonna be up to the date of the minute to the time. This email just rolled into my email box and it is from Carnival Cruise Line themselves. Well, and it so figures it when I want it, I can't find it. Hold tight, man. Hold tight. Hold tight. I'm going to find it. I'm going to find customer support. No, that's not it. There it is. Carnival Cruise Line. Guest advisory. Additional protocol update sailings departing as of September 6th. 2022 August 24th 2022 dear carnival guest it says in addition to the guidelines previously communicated we are expanding acceptable pre-cruise testing for unvaccinated guests for voyages departing September 6th and later these changes are consistent with what local destinations and advisories will be accepting for arrival, cruise guests, and we will continue to work closely with the local destinations to protect the health of our guests, our crew, the community we visit. In addition to the lab administered tests, self-testing is now accepted for unvaccinated guests on cruises of 15 nights and shorter. Certain destinations do not accept unsupervised pre-cruise self-testing, including Bermuda, Canada, Greece, and Spain. If used for visiting these destinations, self-testing must be supervised by a medical professional, regardless of the type of the test taken. Unvaccinated guests will be required to present their negative test results via then fly or as part of the embarkation process. Embarkation, I can't say that word. Additionally, travel insurance is no longer required for unvaccinated guests unless it is required by the destination such as Bermuda. Uh, in retrospect, in, res uh, bleh, in perspective of vaccination status, traveler's insurance is required for all guests visiting Fiji. Details on the new guidelines and additional information for submitting proof of testing, quit that. Proof of testing, I lost my place because of that. You know, proof of testing and other COVID related loaded protocols will be available on the Hive Fun Be Safe webpage of Carnival later today. We encourage you to refer to this information as you prepare for your upcoming cruise and to carefully read any of the following pre cruise communications. We hope you will receive this in good news, and we look forward to welcoming you aboard on October 1st of 2022. Sincerely yours, Christine Duffy, Duffy bleh, President Carnival Cruise Line. So, just like we talked about the other day, this is changing. You no longer have to go to the pharmacy or your doctor. Hey, Laura's calling. You now can do a self-administered test at home, one of the ones the government sent out or one you can get at the pharmacy yourself. There is no more need to have to go pay an expensive pharmacy or doctor for their testing. So you can actually take this while sitting on the couch watching TV, barbecuing at home, whatever you want to be doing, you can take the test and go, okay, it's time to go. 
So, anyway, great news, great news, great news. Uh, that's it. We're going to keep it short and sweet. Bye-bye, people. Hope this helps.